How would you solve for x when you have x squared minus 6x minus 16 is equal to 0? With this x squared and x, we can't simplify it in an easy way to get x by itself. We can simplify this process by doing something called the diamond method, where we take our numerical value, the value at the end, which is negative 16 in this case, and we'll take the middle value, the one associated at x, and put it in the bottom here. We can try to figure out two numbers that multiply to negative 16, but add to negative six. Those two values are negative eight and two. Negative eight times two will give us negative 16. If we add those two values, we will get negative six. We can then put this in a factor form, where we're gonna have it equal to zero, and each one of our parentheses will have an x followed by the numerical values that we have, which is minus eight and positive two. Since we have zero on this side, being in a parentheses form, if this is equal to zero, whatever we have over here, you know, being x or y, whatever we multiply zero by will always end up as zero and vice versa. If this is zero, whatever this could be multiplied by zero is always equal to zero and we can use this information to solve for x. We can set these two equations to equal to zero. x minus eight equals zero, and x plus two is equal to zero. We'll have two cases for values of x. For this one, we're gonna add eight on both sides, so we get that x is equal to eight. We'll subtract two on this one on both sides, so we get that x is equal to negative two. And these two values will be our answers for x.